guys! Welcome to my channel! So today I'm going to be introducing you all to a very special dish for me because my mom used to make this many many times for me when I was younger and I really miss this dish from time to time so I thought one day hey why don't I just make it for myself and on top of that my husband really loves this dish too so what is this dish? It's called the spicy stir-fry tuna. Now there are many other ways to make this, as in you can add in your own ingredients like potatoes, carrots, chives, and so on. But I'm gonna keep it simple, as always. So let's jump right into how I make the spicy stir-fry tuna. Let's go! So we're gonna make the sauce. You need one tablespoon of minced garlic, one tablespoon of plum extract. If you don't have plum extract, you can always use sugar as a replacement. Two tablespoons of soy sauce. And the last ingredient, which is two tablespoons of chili powder. Start mixing all the ingredients together. Make sure you mix well. Now the sauce is all made, so we're gonna go to the next step. You want half an onion. and make sure you cut them in small pieces. So now you need your wok and turn the heat on. Once your wok is hot, add two cans of tuna. So that was 270 grams in total for me. Make sure you stir the tuna for a while or mix it. And then add your onions. Stir them again. your sauce. And the very last step, which is to stir and make sure the sauce is all blended in. So this is the finished product the spicy stir-fried tuna. Voila! Now there are many different ways to enjoy this dish, so let me show you all my first example. You can make your own kimbap using some seaweed and white rice, or you could just add some on crackers. Now there are many different ways to enjoy this dish, so feel free to experiment using the spicy stir-fried tuna. I hope you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to press that like button. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please press that subscribe button. And I will see you again with another delicious dish. Bye.